Hi guys and thanks for tuning in. So there was a question asked, what are some of the things that you just do not do while you're in prison? What are some of the no-no's? So I started thinking and I'm going to remember when I was first arrested and I went to the county and I remember before they took me to my cell thinking, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. Because there was a lot of moments where it was just unbelievable and I felt like I wanted to cry. And I do remember there were several young ladies that were crying and they were calling them names or talking about them. And so, you know, I would tell them, don't cry, don't cry, you know, and then it, and tell them, oh, it, it's going to be okay, so it's going to be okay. Yeah. Then I remember there was a fight and I remember the girl saying that if you're from, somebody in the cell told me if you're from a gang or a neighborhood, then you had to jump in. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, one thing is, you, you can't act scared. I'm sorry, you guys. This is so unfair. I guess I'm just going to be purple. Wow. I guess I'm going to need a new laptop, you guys. So... can act scared and then I, I I would have to say you can't you can't tell you can't tell I remember that fight when the guards came in to break up the fight and they were fighting they were fighting one gang against another gang or one neighborhood against the other neighborhood, which is stupid. And when the cops came in, the cops said, who was doing it and who is it? Who is the one who started this? And nobody said nothing. And I was looking like, say something. Hello? Nope. You can't. You can't say anything. So, if you go to prison, I guess you have to just mind your own business and don't be told. I remember when I went to court and they were transferring us back and remember the whole fight with the homeless, which was crazy. And I remember the, the one girl crying, saying, um, help, help, help. And then they start telling her that they would knock her out if she didn't shut up. Because she was banging on the doors. Officer, officer, help, help, help. Because the homeless, the homeless was fighting. So they were telling her to shut the F up. That, no, you can't tell. So you can't. So that's one thing I would have to say is don't go in there telling. Just mind your own business. And I noticed they did that a lot. Anytime somebody was fighting, nobody would tell. Nobody Stopped it. Everybody mind their own business, okay? If anything, somebody was jumping in. So there's a lot of that went on. Even when somebody was doing ooh, some crazy stuff, you, you can't. There's nothing you can do about it. You got to mind your own business. So that's one thing I suggest is that's a no-no. It's getting into other people's stuff and telling. No, you can't. That's a no-no. And then another no-no is, is I would have to say, um, don't, don't be fooled. Don't, don't think 
you have a friend, don't fall into that whole friend trap. Oh, she my friend. No, she not. No, 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 no. Don't think that somebody's your friend. That's a no, no. Because there's a lot of games being played. Playing. They're waiting on you. And that's the first thing they do is like, I'm going to befriend her. And they're trying to befriend you for a reason. So no, don't. Don't go for it. And, um... Another no-no is don't tell nobody your business. Keep your business to yourself because they'll use that against you. Your your um, your address. Don't tell no, don't give nobody your address for no reason. Don't tell nobody none of your personal information. You got to remember the inmates, they're smart. They're out to, to get money. They're thieves. They're looking for ways to rob you. So you can't, don't be like, don't tell them your business. You got money, don't tell them. Oh, yeah, I got, yeah, me and my um, my husband, yeah, we rich. You know, whatever. Like my husband bought me this. Or my husband sending me all this money in my books. Don't do it. Even, oh, my husband is fine. My husband look good. They're right, your husband. <laughs> I've heard of this. I've seen it, you guys. They will write your husband. They will write your husband and be like, hi. You know, what's up? You know, whatever. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't tell your business. Keep your business to yourself. No, 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 no. Don't trust nobody. Don't trust nobody. I'm telling you. Don't. That's a big one. Don't trust nobody. And what else? What else? No. <laughs> Okay, those are the no no's. I'm gonna leave it at that. Okay, dang, I guess I should have wrote these down because it's probably I'm gonna think of some more. Oh, and then don't fight, don't fight, don't fight, don't let people get to you because they can. But if you find yourself fighting, then you'll get more time. More time, and it's gonna be harder to go home. So don't fight. Don't let people get to you. Keep your mind on Jesus. <laughs> Stay focused on Jesus. Cause man, you fight, you're gonna get more time added, and you find yourself, you're gonna stay there longer. I'm home because I didn't fight. I kept my mind on Jesus. And no no. Man, you, you you get all excited, you know what I mean? Your body, you better take care of your business, do whatever you need to do. Pray to God or something. Don't get caught up in no girlfriend stuff because it's easy to get caught up in that, in that girlfriend. Don't get no girlfriend. There was women that have husbands at home but still had girlfriends. They get caught up, get caught up in emotions and these feelings and stuff. Y'all don't, don't do that. Because it'll turn out all bad. I've seen women get caught up like, what are you doing? Are you crazy? You're not gay? What are you doing? You know, and it's, but she, she nice, but she, 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 she made me feel good. Or she just don't do it because it, it always turns out bad. Then they end up getting beat and stabbed and stomped and locked up and and the rooms is some crazy stuff. Okay. So don't get caught up in your in villains and your 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 flesh. Don't. Because it always turned out bad all the time. And uh, and don't get caught up in doing something you don't have no business doing. Because they will easy, 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 easily, easily try to get you to, to do something. To, to You have visits to have your loved one bring some 
stuff in in the visits or your loved one to go take some stuff to a location and somebody pick it up and bring it in don't get caught up in no illegal stuff don't they gonna try it they gonna if you get visit they they try it they try to talk you into doing some illegal stuff oh would you be interested in making some money no mm -mm. nope don't do it it never fails always <sighs> try to get you caught up in, in some in some stuff um oh it oh i'm not going to talk about that okay and um All right, y'all. That's it. That's it. All right. Okay, that was an excellent, excellent question. Thank you so much for that question. You guys, if you have questions, please feel free to ask, and I'll be more than happy to come back and do a video. All right, you guys. Okay. Until the next video, peace.